Hi everyone, I hope you're all well and welcome to my YouTube channel. If you're new here or if you've forgotten who I am, well, let me introduce myself once again. I am Dolly and I'm passionate about all things beauty and travel and that is the content you will see here on my YouTube channel. In today's video, I'm going to be talking to you about my little Nika haul. Yes, this is all I bought. I didn't buy too much stuff, just stuck to the stuff that I really wanted or stuff that, you know, needed replenishing in my beauty arsenal. Um, the Nika sale is over right now, but there will be Christmas and New Year sales coming up soon. So if you have any of these products in your wish list and you want to know a little bit more about them, then keep watching. So let's begin. If you have been following me on Instagram, then you will know that this was the first product that I added to my pink box. And this is the Huda Beauty Naughty Nude Palette. Um, I was confused between this one and the Mercury Retrograde one, but when I saw the shade swatches, I realized that the Mercury Retrograde had a couple of shades that are very similar to the shades in the Lilac Pastels palette, which I already have. So I went ahead and bought this one because this was at an incredible 40% discount and look at all the shades in it. I don't think I need to say anything about the Huda Beauty eyeshadows because we all know what incredible quality it is and very very wearable colors so whether it's a work look or whether it's a party look you can have a multitude of looks from this one palette and um, yeah in fact my eye makeup today is with this palette using this palette um, the tutorial for this look is on my Instagram so I will be linking that in the description so do go check that out and well yes that was my first purchase then next from Huda Beauty I also bought the four filter foundation stick now this was not on discount and I feel so bad because I bought this at full price I also got uh, a pair of lashes free with it. I got these Samantha lashes free with it, but I paid full price for it. I ordered this, it got delivered to me after two days and the day that it reached me, I saw on Sephora that it was for a 40% discount. Can you, like I just felt so bad. But nevertheless, it's a beautiful foundation. It's, it's very creamy, glides on smoothly, blends very easily. And the shade that I, purchased stress leches is an exact match for me that is what i'm wearing today and as you can see it is a beautiful match for me so the huda products were the two products that were there in my last list in my wish list and uh, those are the ones that i bought because i wanted them the rest are pretty much essentials you know daily use stuff things that i just needed to replenish like this one. This is the Magic Retouch from L'Oreal and I absolutely love it. It's quite a savior when it comes to touching up your roots and you don't have time to color them. Now this next product that I bought, I'll be very honest, I have lost count of how many bottles of this I have emptied up. And if you follow me on Instagram, you would know this is one of my absolute favorite makeup removers. This is the Dr. Shades Moringa and Vitamin C Cleansing Oil. Uh, it gets rid of everything, including waterproof mascara. If I'm doing a lipstick swatch video, then I will take this cleansing oil, you know, just a tiny little dab and I'll use that to remove the long wear lipsticks. But this cleansing oil is absolutely fantastic. My next purchase is again Essentials and that's these Nivea Roll-On Dio's. I've been using Nivea Roll-On Dio since absolutely years. I think pretty much since I was a teen maybe and I love them. Yes, I know that uh, they have aluminum salts in it but these ones seem really good. This one has bio green tea, this one has bio aloe vera. I use them all the time so Essentials which I stocked up on. Then moving on to this one, this is the Osis uh, Schwarzkopf Osis Shine Spray with light control. Now the reason why I bought it is because I do not have any spray at all, any hairspray at all. And I read really good reviews about this. It's supposed to, you know, add shine and control your frizz and is detangling. So I don't really use hairsprays on a regular basis but just in case I need it. And along with this, uh, the freebie that I got was the Schwarzkopf Bonner Cure Hyaluronic Moisture Cake Spray Conditioner. And that brings me to my final one and the one that smells the most amazing. This is the McAfeen Naked and Raw Cappuccino Coffee Body Wash. And this is the hydrating one I believe. Along with that, I also got this pouch of uh, skincare minis, which I'll show you in a bit. So this one, unfortunately, leaked a bit 
in inside so there was this plastic covering on top of it and it leaked inside that plastic covering and I have to tell you it smells amazing this is where you know it all it was all leaking so I tried to clean it up a bit so my caffeine body wash is something I wanted to try since quite a while because I love coffee and in fact it is now my coffee time but I'm gonna wind up this video and then go have it I love the packaging I love that it comes in this packaging that is actually like a coffee cup and this one is the hydrating one um, it's got almond milk in it and it smells like cold coffee. I wish technology allowed me to share the fragrance with you but oh my god I actually feel like drinking it and it's just along with that I received this little chayo. So we have the coffee face mask, we have the coffee face wash and we have the coffee face scrub. That brings me to the end of this video and that was my choto little haul. Uh, just the essentials that I wanted and of course a couple of indulgences. So let me know if you've tried out any of these products or if these products are on your wish list for the next sale. And um, also let me know how you like this eye makeup that I did with the Huda Beauty Naughty Nude Eyeshadow Palette. Also let me know in the comments if you would like me to do videos in Gujarati. And um, if you have liked this video, please do give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends and subscribe to my channel. I'll see you soon and I promise you I will be making more content for YouTube. Bye!